ups and downs are worth it Long way to go, but we're working We're flawed, but we're still perfect for each other Yeah, yeah, yeah Sometimes I thought we'd never see the light We went through hell with heaven on our side This beach ain't always been no paradise The nightmares only last one night No more clubs and Cali curfew Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna be doing a review slash setup of this digital clock you guys that I received. It's a wooden digital alarm clock. And since I moved to the new place y'all, I've been kind of looking for a digital alarm clock. Um, I've been needing an alarm just besides my phone. So I was really excited to collaborate with this company and the name of the company is called Woola, hope I'm pronouncing that right. Woola Wendy and they sent me this wooden digital alarm clock. So I'm gonna show you guys. You can find this exactly alarm clock on Amazon I will have all the links listed below for you guys so I'm gonna show you guys what I have in here because I don't want to make it too long and I'm also going to show you guys how to work the clock so whenever you go purchase your own one you'll know how to work it it's really inexpensive and I love the fact that it's modern good for office as well as like bedrooms so I'm really excited about it and I'm really excited to show you guys how it looks so it came packaged in this box and it came with of course the um, adapter card for you to plug into it and it also can operate off of batteries as well. So you have your instructions in here and the instructions does come in English and I think another language as well. Nope, just all English. So I have the English instructions. And um, it also has a barcode. I'm not quite sure maybe if you need to return it or any of that good stuff. Maybe that's why the barcode is in there. So it's really, really sleek, you guys. It's really modern. I love the fact that it's like a, a fake wood. Maybe it is a real wood, but it's really sleek, really modern, you guys. So I'm gonna show you guys how it works, how it works and all that good stuff. Here's the back of it. And it has, of course, where the batteries go. And you can use three AAA batteries if you want to use batteries, but I'm going to plug mine up. And most likely I'm going to just keep mine plugged up, but if there's a storm coming or anything like that, you can definitely use batteries. Um, it has a down button, a up button, a set, and then it also has where you can reset it here. And then the um, part for the adapter. So whenever you plug it in, so I'm going to get it turned on and everything, get it plugged up for you guys and everything. And we're going to go through it and I'm going to show y'all how it works. And as well as give you guys... Okay, y'all, so I kind of have y'all at an awkward angle. I need to get a drop cord for my dresser so I can put the clock up on my dresser, and I definitely would do that. But I want to go ahead and show you guys how everything works. So I have the cord already plugged in. It's a pretty long cord, you guys, so it's pretty long. I'm just going to plug it into the back. And then it comes on. So I'm going to kind of play with the buttons in the back so we can figure out what they do. Uh, we're going to set it first. So we're going to select set. And I just pressed it. So display one, if you want to set to display one, it'll show you every 10 seconds. It'll show you the time, the date, as well as the temperature. So you can do that one. Or you can do displaying display two. And display two keeps on just the time. So it doesn't change at all if you have it on display two. But I think I'm going to do display one. All right. So we're going to mash up. All right. And that's the temperature. You can change that as well go up we can change that one to change that I'll put it back on display one and it has a temperature if you want to change it or you can leave it the same all right then we have the sound well SD stands for sound if you have it like this sound on it means if you tap it or if you tap the dresser it'll come on and if you don't have it if you have it like this that means that it'll just stay on at all times so we're going to try to set our time, get our time situated because our time needs to be set. So we're going to hold set. All right. And it gives us the year. So we can mesh up to change the year. It's 2018. Go mesh set. All right. We're not in March. Any, I mean, in May anymore. So we're going to go up to nine. All right. And then we're going to change the date. Let's go down. And today's date is the seventh. It is seven days before my birthday, y'all. My birthday is in seven more days. And that shocking here has a loud beeping on. I like that. So we got our date set. All right. Oh, did I change that? I'm sorry, y'all. 
I'm over here not paying attention. Okay, so we got our date set. All right, and then this is the time. So let's change the time. And it is four. I'm gonna say it's about five, y'all. I need to go get the exact time. I want to say it's like five fifty-three. We're gonna say it's five fifty-three for now. I mean four fifty-three for now. It's around that time. I'll make sure to change to, change to the correct time. Hit set again. And then this is if you want to set an alarm, you can set up to three alarms. So this is the first alarm, second alarm. And a third alarm, which will be good for me because I'm gonna need to set three alarms. So I'm gonna need that. All right, so we can go back to display one because we want it to change from the time to the temperature and the date. And I want the time out so I can show you guys how it comes back on, but it's a really, really nice clock. Um, a couple features about it is it's multi-functional. It displays the time, the date, the time, the date, as well as the temperature. You have three alarm settings, as I mentioned before. You can adjust the brightness. And let me show you guys how to adjust the brightness. So we're going to press and hold the up button. Right here, we're going to press and hold the up button. All right, and when we press and hold the up button, let's see, make sure I'm doing this right. All right, so LO is the darkest. L1 is the brightest. LO is the darkest. And this is the brightest. So L3 is the brightest. Then there's L2, L1, and L0. So we're going to go with L3 because I want it bright. I want it good and bright. So I'm going to sit right here. Then once I have that set, we're good to go. So, and I'm going to just place it back right here. And I want it to time out so I can tap it and you guys can see that good stuff. Um, also, is really modern it's really sleek it's a really nice design once again i have all the links listed for you guys in the description box and i'll also add a link in the comments as well it's really up it's really inexpensive it's really modern i think it goes perfect with my room so yeah you guys if you're interested definitely um hit the link below it'll head you straight over to exactly why i ordered the clock once again this is woola wendy it's the brand and it's a wood and digital alarm clock and I hope you guys enjoyed this quick review and quick setup. And if you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed. I'm still waiting on the time out, but it has not timed out yet. But this is so cute, y'all. Like, it's, it's so cute. It's so cute. It's so modern. I love that it gives me the time, the date, and the temperature. And it says it's 88 in here. It literally is 88 in here. But that's a whole nother story for a vlog. Um, but anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.